You guys ready to go get clean? Megan, are you ready? Oh yeah, this is ready. Whoa! <laughs> this is not the right floor. Move your heads before they get smashed in the door. She pulled it out. Thank you. I made it. It's Monday morning and it's gonna be crazy because one of my coworkers that I covered, she's out this week. So I gotta cover her job and my job. And I start shooting on Friday and Saturday and I have to memorize my lines and I have an audition due tomorrow. And I have a conference call for the children's clothing giveaway this afternoon. So it's gonna be a stressful week. <laughs> Wish me luck. Later. Lordy, lordy, lord. Today was a long day. Please, when the lights get dark, it's unconditional. When the robbery don't stop, tell me when your loyalty is coming from the heart. <laughs> my lunch today with some of last night's leftovers and cut up some fresh strawberries and just threw those in there for I guess just to fill up the space <laughs> but it's also a healthy option so whatever but yeah this is a uh, lunch um, someone brought us Primo's donuts today I already took mine out I got a twist on my way to get my hair done. I spent the whole day pretty much at the space. We are partnering with another organization for an event next month. So I spent the whole day getting sweaty and dirty and going through bags and pulling stuff for this event, thinking that I was gonna have enough time to go home and freshen up before my hair appointment, but that didn't happen. So I'm looking pretty crazy right now. So I hope that she doesn't, you know, me out when I get there but 
I'm headed to get my hair done. I can't wait. Um, I don't know if you guys saw a couple months ago I put up a reel where I got my hair relaxed. That's basically what I'm going to get done again today. It's the same person. She did an awesome job the first time. So I'm excited to be going back. So yeah, so I'll let you guys see the end result when I when I come out. I'm all done. My hair looks so nice. It grew, she said, about two and a half, three inches since I got it done in April. Which is pretty good. Three inches in four months. That's pretty good, I think. Um, and then she probably cut about an inch off because it was kind of uneven. It was a little longer on this side than it was on this side. So she kind of evened it out for me. But I love it. It looks so good. It looks so bouncy and healthy. I love coming to her. I don't know if I have told you guys about what um, we've been binging lately. We just finished The Boys on Amazon Prime, which is such a good show. If you have not seen it or you've never heard of it, you should check it out. It's, it, I mean, it's gory. There's like some sex stuff in there that's not the best for, you know, minors or kids or whatever, so I wouldn't watch it with my kids. But the story and the action and character development, all those things are excellent. Um, there's, I think, three seasons total. We binged and watched all three seasons over the last like month or month and a half and now I have moved on to Squid Game I've just started watching that I actually just started yesterday I watched the first two episodes so I might be watching that tonight I do need to work on the script for the project that I'm shooting next week it got pushed back I don't know if I've already said that but it got pushed back a couple weeks because someone um, in the cast got COVID so it had to get pushed back so I need to work on um, my lines, mem memorizing my lines. I need to work on just the character development, um, wardrobe, how I'm going to do my hair, which is really why I wanted to get my hair done today, so it's easier to do next week on set. Um, i got to go get my nails done probably the day before we shoot because you're going to see my hand. So that's it. I just wanted to get you guys caught up on my day, um, what I'm going to do this weekend. I hope that everyone else is having a fun and restful and relaxing weekend. What are some of the things you like to do during the weekend? Like your errands, um, self-care, cleaning, kid stuff, meal prep. What are some of the types of things you guys like to do? I, I don't want to spend my whole weekend working. I'm trying to find new things to do. Um, or binging. Do you guys binge watch stuff? If you do, what kind of things are you guys watching right now? I don't know. Let me know in the comments. Happy Sunday afternoon. I just pulled up to the space. I have some work that I need to get done here today. Um, I worshiped this morning. I actually picked up some donations this afternoon and um, wanted to bring them here because it's part of uh, the partnership that I was explaining to you guys yesterday um, with the other nonprofit, so I got to get that stuff together. I stopped and got some Starbucks, like I guess like for a late lunch because I haven't had lunch, and I just scarfed down my uh, my grilled cheese that I got from there. But I got this drink which I got last Sunday. Oh, can you guys even see it? I don't know. Let me see. Press that. Okay, there we go that I got um, last Sunday, and don't mind my nails, I'm, I'm getting those done in a few days before I shoot, but um, anyways, I, what did I do with my straw? Um, oh, there it is. Um, I got this drink last Sunday when I took Kenya out to um, Glendale, to that Goodwill, and um, we got it when we got back to Santa Monica. And at first it was like, this is like really strong. This is really interesting. Um, but then I started to like it. It's the iced, the iced toasted vanilla oat milk shaken espresso. I remembered so I could say it all. 
But anyway, so today I went back to that same um, Starbucks and I got the same drink because I liked it last week. It's really good, I think. Um, some might say it's not sweet enough, so you might want to add more. Um, I guess it's like cinnamon. Tastes like cinnamon. Um, you might want to add more things to make it sweeter, but I like the amount of sweetness that it has, so I'm pretty good with that. But um, I'm at the space. I'm collecting trash from my car, which my kids and my husband like to leave behind. I'm here. I'm going to be here for about an hour. I'm also working on memorizing my lines for my shoot this weekend, um, which I think I have about, I have it about mm, maybe 65% memorized, but the thing about memorization for me when I'm memorizing lines, the sooner I can get it 100% memorized, the better, because then I can focus on how I want to say the lines. So once I get the lines memorized, that's when the fun starts for me. I can start playing with the lines, playing with the delivery, playing with the character. So I actually wanted to be off book sooner than now. But as you guys know, I just have so much stuff going on. So it's like, it wasn't, it wasn't possible. So I'm hoping that by the end of the day today, or at the latest um, tomorrow afternoon, I want to be completely off book. So that I have the lines up here and I can just be running them when I'm at the gym or when I'm at work or when I'm driving and I don't have to have, you know, my script in front of me to do that. So that's where I am. That's what I'm doing. Multitasking. And I need to get out of the car because it's like 80 something degrees. It's burning up. So I might pull you guys back out when I get inside of the space. If not, then I'll check in with you guys later or tomorrow. My life seems... Well, that's kind of boring. I'm sorry, you guys. I really don't have a whole lot to share, but um, I love my hair. I need my little fan. It's so hot in here. Oh my goodness. So this is what we bagged up. I've been collecting these for about a week and a half now, but we bagged them up yesterday when we were here for appointments. So here's one bag of 50 for girls. There's another bag of 50 for girls. So that's 100. Here's one bag of 50 for boys boys and another for boys so right here we have 200 pair and then the bag i just showed you guys which has 32 for boys and then over here is another bag for girls with 44 so what is that that's 276 so halfway there so yeah so now i'm about to get really hot and sweaty because like i said i have to go to our surplus room and look for more um, they're supposed to be coming by on Thursday afternoon to pick this up. So I have a few more days to get this ready for them to pick up. Okay, so I am back with the tally for tonight. So over here we have six bags of 50, so that's 300. Here we have 27. And here we have 41, so we are at 368, which means hopefully if I come back one more time this week, I can come up with the rest so that we can hit 500. Um, I actually want to go beyond 500 if I can, but I want to have at least 500. Over here you can see a toy project that one of my daughters was working on. She did not finish, but that will be cleaned up before we take appointments later this week. Um... So yeah, so that's where we are. I gotta leave now. I gotta go pick one of my daughters up from a babysitting gig and go home and try to shower and eat and go to bed so I can get ready for work in the morning. This is my life, y'all. This is why I, ha I have no social life because I'm always doing stuff like this. It takes up all my time. But yeah, so we're at 368. Yay! I'm happy. The next day. It's 
Tuesday evening. And when I say Tuesday evening, I mean it's 6.30. I got off work about an hour ago. I went home, picked Kenya up, took her to her babysitting job. And now I am sitting outside the space. I'm about to go inside. And we're going to pull the rest of those bottoms. We're going to pull the rest of those bottoms that I need for Thursday. I'm hoping that I can find all of them or the rest of them tonight so that way I don't have to come back tomorrow. I can wait until Thursday to come back when they are scheduled to be picked up. So that is my prayer because sis is tired. I am so very tired, but I'm sure you guys are tired of hearing me say I'm tired, but I didn't get much sleep last night. I don't know if I've ever told you guys that I have these neighbors, actually two sets of neighbors, with two sets of kids that drive me crazy. Ironically, because I love doing stuff for kids. I love kids. I love working with kids. I love meeting kids. But these two sets of kids drive me insane. One set of them lives above me, and they make as much noise as possible. And it's been going on for quite some time, for several years, and you would think that as they get older, they'll learn manners and maybe not be as loud or annoying, but that's not the case. It's only gotten worse because they've gotten heavier and larger and way more, so they make more noise. <laughs> and yes, I've complained to management, and it, it, it gets better for a minute or two, and then it's back the same way again. But anyways, that's why I'm extra tired today. I didn't get a whole lot of sleep. So I'm hoping that I can get in here, do what I need to do. Leave, go get Kenya, go home, take my shower, eat something, and get in the bed. Which is my agenda for every evening, as you guys know. So, that's what I'm doing now. Work was pretty good. Don't mind this blemish on my face. It's like a pimple. Um which sucks because I shoot this weekend and it's like I always get like crap on my face right before I'm about to shoot something I get like a really big pimple for some reason and then I have to do all these things to try to get rid of it but anywho I'm just rambling at this point because I'm tired <laughs> but everything else has been going good I've been, I went to the gym last night I've been going to the gym I'm supposed to meditate later I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it though um, since I'm going to be here, but we'll see. My blood pressure has been great. Um, other than the last couple of nights, I've been resting pretty good. So things have been going good. I've been meeting my goals and taking care of stuff. And I'm almost done memorizing the lines for this weekend. Although we did get one uh, script. <laughs> that dog is so funny. <laughs> and we thought our dog is that. That's so funny. Like the little puppies on the leashes that don't want to, well, this dog looks like it weighs 100 pounds, but the dogs that don't want to walk on the leash and they're trying to bite the leash and pull it out of your hands, that's what that dog is doing. Um, but anywho, I, what was I saying? I've been, I've been, everything's been good. Um, other than it's just being a lot of things to do, I've been managing and I've been getting them done, so I'm happy with that. But let's get in here, let's pull these bottoms, and I will check in with you guys when I'm done, see if I met my goal. Okay, so I only had about an hour up here tonight, um, and then I kept getting distracted because I kept getting phone calls and texts and stuff like that. But I did find 27 pair, I found 18 girls and 9 boys, so that's, that's pretty good. Um, I think I'm down to now, still need 100 pair. So hopefully tomorrow, now i got to come back tomorrow, hopefully tomorrow I can find the rest of what I need. Alright, that's it. I'm heading out. Hello, hello, hello. I'm picking up a cake today for our office birthday celebration, which we do once a month to celebrate the birthdays during that month. And I ordered this month's cake from Hanson, the same place that I got my daughter's cake from had her birthday earlier this month and so that's where I'm headed right now it is burning up it's like it's like mid 80s right now and I can't turn on my AC because I'm low on gas I gotta stop at the gas station too and 
I don't want to run out of gas I'm trying to get over here so I'm going to go pick up the cake I'm going to go get some gas at one of my favorite low cost gas stations I have several that I pinpoint I know they have the, the best prices and then I'm going to get some lunch and head back to the office my daughter is going to go to the space today and help finish finding all of the bottoms that we need the special project that we've been working on for the partnership that we've been working on. So I'm excited about that, which means tonight when I go, it should be a really quick process to go ahead and get everything together. Then I can get home and go to the gym as I as I normally would on Wednesday. So hopefully she has luck finding what we need. I want to take you guys through, hopefully through tomorrow when the pickup actually happens. I would like to start showing you guys more of the nonprofit side of what I do since it takes up so much of my time because I think it's interesting, it's fun, and it makes me feel good helping other people and it might make, make you guys feel good watching it. I don't know. And then um, I'll probably end the vlog tomorrow at that time and then I'll start a new vlog on Friday when I start my, my uh, new acting project that I'm working on. There's one of my favorite cheap gas stations. It's on the corner of Robertson and Olympic. I used to go to this gas station all the time when I worked in Century City. As you can see, it's pretty packed, so hopefully I can get in there and get some gas and get out. But that's just a quick tip. If you live in LA or if you come visit LA, this is a good place to stop for gas because it's usually one of the cheaper places to go. Thank you. Okay, so I filled up, you guys. It was really good. It was only $4.99 a gallon. $74 bucks filled me up. So yeah, it was only $74 bucks to fill me up. That's really good considering where gas prices were just a month or two ago. So, gas is done. So let me go on to my next stop. Almost time for cake. It's chocolate. So pretty. Their cakes are always so pretty. Later. Can y'all see that? My dumb behind wore white today. Going through all these bags and I got dust all over my white jeans. Hopefully they're not ruined. I gotta wash them and see. <sighs> okay, it is done. It is done. 10 bags of 50. We got 500 pairs of bottoms ready for pickup tomorrow. I included some of my business cards and some of Todd's business cards. This is ready for pickup. I'm so happy. Tay, you wanna be on camera? No, I do not. <laughs> Taya I'm helped me. <laughs> Taya helped me wrap up tonight, so I'm so grateful. It's like after eight o'clock right now, but we got it done. We got it done. Yes. Good morning and happy Thursday. It's actually my Friday, so happy Friday to me because I have tomorrow off. I just made it to work and um, just finished eating my waffles with a spoon because clearly I have teenagers who like to load the dishwasher but not start it. You guys have that too? <laughs> so there's never any clean forks. I want to just check in because I want to finish the vlog today. So just want to let you guys know that you're going to see me um, have that uh, donation picked up today. I'm going to be working. Um, I need to go get my nails done, my brows done for the shoot tomorrow. I need to go to the gym because I didn't go yesterday because we were there until really late pulling the stuff for the donation. And I also have meditation tonight. They sent me a new script last night with additional lines, which I need to work on. So I have a lot to do today. We're going to try to get through it quickly, though. So, well, you guys are going to see it quickly. For me, it's going to take all day. Trying to figure out why my plant is growing mushrooms. That is so creepy. Creepy. It has 
been a day. It's been a day. And it's not even noon. So you can see where I am right now. Just 10 minutes though. That's all I can spare. I'm not the problem, man, that's on you, yeah. You've been terrorizing me, yeah, I'm always wrong. I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb. Girl, are you crazy? Yeah, you must be crazy. Okay, this is all ready for pickup. Ten bags, just waiting for them to come. Right. So the clothes were picked up and this is what we got in return, which is what we so desperately needed, large diapers. Yeah, we love partnering with other organizations for the whole thing of whites, which we need, and diapers. So it's all worth the effort. There's Taya, heading off on her own. <laughs> I'm headed to get my nails done. And y'all, what did I just get? A last minute audition that's due in the morning. So I gotta do that tonight too. One hour later. I'm all done. My toes are white and my nails are like really a natural color. Oh, Taya's here. I was waiting for Taya. She's here. Yeah.